Hello, hello everybody. This is Sheila with Simply Simple Creations by Sheila and today we are going to make the cutest house you guys. Just bear with me as we get to that part. My videos are so short um, and simple in this part that I try to, you know, I try to speed it up as fast as I can but you have to watch a lot of painting. So I started off with spraying this with water just because my chalk paint was really thick and y'all saw me at the beginning I had to dab some of it because I put too much on there. But anyway, I am giving it a good coat of paint and then I'm going to dry it and I'm painting the front, back, bottom, top, sides, all of it because I want it to be a finished product if you turn it around or if you sit it on a shelf sitter. And I could have actually put two of these um, napkins on here on the front and the back and I just now thought of that. So you know that's how it is. Here I am painting the back and I put more water on it just to show y'all. I didn't get as much this time but I still dabbed it. But it just makes that paint go on a lot smoother. And then once we get it all cleaned up and got all of our lines out of it, I um, went and dried it again. I didn't make you watch that. So next we're going to take Mod Podge and we're going to give this a really good coat of Mod Podge. And you're going to see me like going back and forth. I'm trying to um, make sure that I get all the ends covered, not ends, edges, edges covered with the Mod Podge because our next part has to have something to stick to it. I'm not telling y'all what the next part is. Or did I already tell you that? I don't remember. Anywho, I found these cute napkins, y'all. Look, there's, so there's four of them. They're front, back, and then when you open it, there's two more. And i already taken the back off of it, and then I put it on there. I wanted that door to be on there completely. Um, so I'm doing this in real time so you see this, the whole thing of it, and I apologize for that. I probably should have sped this part up too, but I forgot to. And then my video would have been too short because, you know, we have to have them so many minutes long. So then I'm taking my Teflon sheet. I got this from Amazon, and I'm just going over it with the iron to get all of the wrinkles out of it. I don't want there to be any wrinkles in it. But you guys, this turned out so cute. And wait till the end to see how I staged it. Um, look how adorable that is. So there's extra. And like I said, I could have like either wrapped it or I could have done another one on the back. But I just took my sanding sponge or sanding block, whatever it's called, the gator. It's a gator. I got it. I got mine from Lowe's, but you can get them on Amazon. You can get them on, um, at Walmart. You can get them at Lowe's. You can get them at Home Depot. Timu probably has them. Actually, I know Timu has them because Brown Eye Girls Crafting got some from there. But, um, once all of that is sanded off, you have a really super cute little house. Now, these houses, this one I cut myself. Well, I didn't cut it. Mr. Terry cut it. But, um, he cut it, and that is what we have. And look how cute that is. 